Hello everyone, this is Te Liu. Today I'm going to talk about large precision homomorphic sign evaluation using few key feature bootstrapping. It's a joint work with Daniela Michancho and Yuri Polikov. So first some background information. Uh, we, in this paper, we use uh, functional or programmable bootstrapping. What that means is that it basically we can evaluate an arbitrary negacyclic function basically for free while also performing some bootstrapping over LW Cephrodex. This is first introduced in DM15 and it has two constraints. The first one is that uh, it requires a negacyclic function. Uh, negacyclic basically means that for some input x and zq, uh, you need to satisfy that f of x equals to negative of f of x plus q over t. You can see this is a relatively strong restriction. And the second restri restriction is that we can only evaluate functions for messages up to k bits of precision and usually k is equal to five or six. Uh, basically, the runtime exponential is exponential in the in the number of uh, bits. So, for more than five or six bits, the runtime will be relatively impractical. And there are two uh, bootstrapping methods discussed in the paper. The first one is few uh, introduced in DM15. Uh, it can efficiently support uh, arbitrary secrets, but the bootstrapping key size is relatively large. And the second method is TFG. It, it's introduced in CGG I16, and it provides better runtime performance for small secrets like binary ternary, and the bootstrapping key size is much smaller. We see MP21 uh, for detailed comparison and see uh, this new paper for third method. Uh, this is, comes after our paper is published, so it's not included in the paper. In this paper, we use uh, functional bootstrapping as a black box. So uh, any of these uh, methods will work for us. And the main result of this work is that we added some uh, new powerful tools to the TFG a uh, few uh, schemes. And, and um, the, the main tools uh, are the following. The first one is large precision comparisons. And why comparison first? Uh, because comparisons are widely used in ML vaccine inference or DTT training and data science. And comparisons are also uh, considered hard to be used uh, via homomorphic encryption. As you know, the current runtime is exponential uh, with the number of bits, uh, and we want them to make the runtime linear scale. And the second tool we provide is the large precision arbitrary function evaluation. Now it only supports negacyclic function and supports only small precision. We have implemented our schemes, and the implementation is open sourced in OpenFG and Palisade libraries. Let me conclude this abstract talk by uh, describing our very uh, very high level idea. And is that is, well, our first observation is that the comparison is equivalent to our sign evaluation. So to compare A and B, we just need to find the sign of A minus B. And the sign evaluation is equivalent to uh, computing the most significant bits and the computing the MSB is the central part of few TV cheaper survey. To uh, evaluate it for large precision, our method is to remove the large numbers digits gradually. For example, we have this uh, 18 bits. We first uh, remove the last six bits, and then remove the uh, central six bit, the, the middle six bits, and then when we have only six bits left, we can use a uh, few bootstrapping uh, to uh, directly uh, extract the most significant. However, uh, directly remove these bits by things like uh, modular switching is not acceptable because there are they will introduce some errors. Uh, to know what technique, what is exact the technique we used and introduced in the paper, uh, please come to the full talk. It will be on Tuesday, December sixth, uh, five to, uh, twenty-five, and um, it will be uh, GMT plus eight uh, time zone. Uh, thank you for listening.